Hello everybody and welcome back to another video with Sons of the Forest and having fun by manipulate your save game file. Well, I'm proud to announce that I just released a script that will include any other script I currently released. So you're able to do with the script just revive every NPC that is down, of course friendly like Calvin and Virginia, not enemies. And you can multiply them by add additional NPCs like Calvin and Virginia to your game. Also, there's a third option now available to take your inventory stuff in seconds to another save game. For example, you done a single player, then you extract your inventory data.json, put it into the script directory. And then the script is capable of copying your inventory just to another save game. Probably you join a friend online and you want to take your stuff with you. Then the process is extremely easy. Just save your game because my script will look for your latest save game. So, had to quit. Head to my website sirbash.com there we got the Discord link. If you would like to provide any feedback or just join the community, you're welcome. Or if you just want to have the script, click on GitHub Stuff I Develop, then go to Repositories, and then Sons of the Forest Toolbox. All right, so good. Then click on the green button, then download zip. Just choose a location, then extract the zip file. Open the two folders, right click on init.cmd, say properties and allow the execution of the init.cmd. Because the init.cmd is the trigger or the initializer for the PowerShell and the script is completely written in PowerShell. So if you're interested in, you can just read the code as you like. So there's nothing that a script will hide from you. <laughs> it's probably a little bit stuff to read, but I think it's okay. All right, anyway, there's the player imagery save data.json I provide. You can replace it with yours. And to launch a script, just double click it. And the script is asking you, hey, what can I do for you today? First, insert your inventory. I will say, yes, I want to do my inventory. So the script says, all right, I've inserted inventory here. All right, let's start it over. And then I have no dead NPCs, but I want to add additional NPCs. So I say three. And now it's asking me how many of them. I say, okay, well, I have five Virginias. I believe that five is currently a kind of capacity limit in this game. I did some experiments and after I killed a lot of them, the next one appeared. I have no clue how the game that handle, but five to the same time is no problem. So, but for Calvin, <laughs> that is very interesting, is not having a kind of spawn limit or capacity limit at all. Just can go with, uh, I can go with 25, that's okay. Then it's asking for the spawn location. But currently the snow is not implemented, but currently I'm in the forest, so I take the two. And every dot represent an injection of the NPC into your game file. So, it's done. Then head over to your later save game. Just say multiplayer host, continue, and here we go, start. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> so, now you get a bunch of friends. All right, just let's do the next experiment. Obviously, it hurt my heart to do that. And on the other side, I have no clue how to kill them really, really fast. Probably I should open 
public server. Let other that do for me. Because it's it's really it's really nasty. Well, look that to me. Red Bumpy. Okay, then let's revive them again. Uh, let me see that. Where we got it? Ah, here. Just give it a stick. And let's save your game. Right. Quick quit. And right after, run the script again. This time select two to revive all your NPCs. That's it. Well, if everything went well, your NPCs are even stronger than before. So, let's test it out. Yeah, it's like here on GitHub, because I added health 999. <laughs> also for Virginia. I believe the script should also work when you can't interact with your NPC. So you see your NPC probably walking around or staying around, I don't know. Okay, this is uh, not one of my NPCs that should be alive, so it's okay. It's just an asset. And as you can see, we have a lot of caverns going on here. It would be nice if can see at least one of the Virginias. Oh, 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 there, 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 I can see it. Yeah, looks good to me. So obviously, what I'm going to do now <laughs> is just open the public server. And I call the server, please help me with all that Calvins. And I spawn like, don't know, like 200, I guess. Well, to be honest, it is pretty performance intense to have so much cannons around you to the same time. And even if they, if they are dead, lying around, doing nothing, it is very performance intense. So <laughs> keep that in mind when you do that. All right, have fun.